Hey YouTube, Ham and America's Chicken back here again. I want to talk a minute about, uh, or spend a minute talking rather, about something that has come up in a lot of emails and comments, especially with the first aid kits. You know, I've been putting them in these BDU organizer pouches, and the comments I get are, I didn't know, they came in different sizes, or where do you get them, or, or what are they? You know, can I use them for other things? Well, of course you can. You have to understand, everything I show you here is just a version compiled together to create a different item. That's what I do. I take stuff off the shelf from drugstore, box store, surplus store, uh... Home Depot, auto parts store, doesn't matter. And I take the pieces and I put them together to make something that works for me. It may not work for you, but it doesn't mean some of the components can't work for you. So I thought I'd take a minute and just go over these BDU pouches and exactly what they are and how they came about and, and what your options are. If you were in the military, even now, uh, a couple of decades ago, the one thing you learn about the military real quick, nowadays I believe it's a lot different, but back then the one thing you learned about military organization, it was a term like military intelligence. Not really conducive, okay? Yeah, they had a lot of stuff, and yeah, they had stuff to carry it in, but no way to organize it in your bag. Your drill sergeant or somebody else would show you ways that worked for them, maybe not for you, and there was always stuff floating around. Okay. Yeah, you could wrap it up in other things like blankets or shirts or ponchos or whatever, but always stuff, especially if you were more in a, a more administrative sort of thing, there really wasn't a lot going for you. Well, organizer pouches came about from this very thing. We needed to organize our materials, get them in one convenient grab pack that could be thrown in a larger bag and jump and that's how they came about and a lot of people think well you know yeah they came from Maxpedition no Maxpedition makes a very good version of these but they do not get credit for this I believe the credit goes to a company right down here in Norfolk Virginia called Blackhawk okay now they've been around for a long time and they in my opinion make some of the finest tactical gear around they're certainly not cheap but they're not as expensive as some of the other people it's not to slight people like 511 and tactical tailor and a lot of these other companies that are making things there's as many people on the bandwagon now as there are needs and there is a growing need all the time but I believe the organizers came about originally from a contract that Blackhawk Industries had and they started with various sizes this is one of their early organizer pouches now this was designed to go into a case presumably, presumably for a field command this I think would be a very old ancestor of the monkey combat pouch that you see now that I actually have a couple of uh, that are a very convenient way to store small things in a BDU pocket. This really wasn't made for a BDU pocket, it was made for a larger case, but it was designed to hold your smaller stuff. Inside here you have things like a window ID holder and it was a multi-layered sewn-in flap on both sides that allowed you to accommodate a great deal of things, even at a key retention thing in here. But uh, it was nice, it would expand out as much as you had stuff in there. It had the trademark webbing on the outside held together with velcro how many times have you seen that I really think the credit for this design goes to Blackhawk Industries I mean they're in my mind they're the first company I saw that had them not really even molly strapping this was designed to just run through things on a briefcase or whatever and uh, it even had another expansion pack in the back so it was a very very good tactical operations command holder well you know why not the grunts why not the guys with boots on the ground so they came up with a smaller version the now worldwide famous oops sorry Fred oh, I'm sorry buddy keeps doing it every once in a while right, you're about to lose your uh, your saw <laughs> jeez I still think that's a sniper rifle anyway 
I this is the black again I think you can see the Black Hawk version of the now very famous design BD organizer it was designed to go into standard issue basic duty uniform pockets and again the interior that you're all familiar with um, two sides with the vertical holders now theirs in the beginning did not have the stitch down the middle to make two narrower compartments it was just one large compartment you could put things in here like a notebook other papers uh, early sniper cases I know a lot of shooters that use these to carry their sniper data books and other things now there has since been cases made specifically for that task but these BDU organizers and again the trademark webbing with the velcro in the front notice no velcro patch as of yet on the top for the flag that came about from other manufacturers Maxpedition made that modification but the more familiar molly strapping here but now see again not really molly strapping because it is sewn not snapped so again designed to hook on to something which made it very convenient to put th a backpack strap or something else through to give you an outside holder if you weren't inclined to carry it in the BDU so that's the Blackhawk version compare that to this one from Fox and you can see how the generations have involved we'll go through that they've rounded off the corners more but this was the traditional design again by Blackhawk that was picked up by other manufacturers and I believe including Maxpedition to come out with the BDU organizer so props to these guys they're a hell of a company uh, if you get a chance to check out their website they've got some amazing tactical gear I don't get anything out of it I'm just recommending stuff that works for me okay and uh, you know there's the way it's sold in the stores Blackhawk the world's finest tactical gear I'll tell you what I think they get my vote and for nothing else but the really cool packaging they were the first guys to put the collapsible or the closure on the bottom so you could leave it intact you wanted to take it out and check it out that's fine open it up pull it out check out the goods then when you're done you put it back in the pouch or the salesman does and just zip it back up for the next guy to use I just broke it do you believe that well we'll, uh, we'll fix that but anyway real-time television folks that's Blackhawk. Then came Maxpedition and other manufacturers. You've seen me take these cases and make various things. The first aid packs. This is actually not a first aid kit. This is something I carry in my tack vests all the time. I call this the office. It's got a notebook. It's got uh, pens, pencils, other writing instruments. It's got the ID in the plastic ID window that comes down now again the stitching remember the Blackhawk this has got the stitching now to make the two vertical pockets I carry things in there like small flashlights tools this is actually insect repellent sold in uh, the pen type form which comes in very handy especially on location but again this will slip since I wear cargo pants this will slip into the cargo pants pocket or a vest pocket works very well and of course the now famous velcro patch holder on the top with the traditional camo series American flag and of course they come in various colors now you'll notice two generations here this is the more routinely scored off ones I like these better there really isn't a loss of volume on the inside maybe a very slight amount with the rounded off corners but I just like the squared off it it seems to expand a little better because of the squared off corners nowadays you're gonna find them like this okay the corner is rounded off here it's still basically the same inside it's got the retention for the keys or whatever else it's got the slots on the one side uh, if you're lucky it'll be the vinyl coating so it is slightly water resistant not waterproof not with a zipper remember that but water resistant uh, and the pouches but I think you've got a little bit more room for expansion with the more traditional squared size but you can find both styles online and of course in your local store and then there's the minis same thing the minis are more the traditional squared off size and again fully functional on the inside uh, it's got the heavy duty zippers on it so at first first couple of times it may be a little bit more difficult to open but once you do you'll see that the inside is exactly the same our friends at Voodoo Tactical make this one Fox Tactical makes uh, some of this other stuff 
the other size of a BDU pouch. Now, they also come out with their version of the larger size. Now again, here's how you use one for a, a use that it may have not been intended for. I find these are perfect, perfect size for my e-reader. You know, you'll go online, go to a store and find all these cases for your e-reader. This holds everything. It holds the charger, the USB cord, a magnifying lens that goes on top because I'm old. Thank you. Uh, the reader itself, the pow power supply, There's still a lot of extra room. It travels extremely well, protects it. I mean, I've had it in all kinds of luggage and through all kinds of airports and checkpoints and everything's always been fine with it. Um, and again, it's got now the thing you're going to find in all the new generation, which is the Molly strapping. And again, don't get anything from them, but I like Voodoo Tactical's way of doing this because it gives you the expansion joint at the top of the Molly strap. Makes it a lot easier in a close cinch situation where you've got opposing straps coming in and not a lot of room. It gives you that little extra headroom to be able to weave the strap through and connect it so it's a very, very solid attachment. So, BDU packs. Various colors, various sizes, various manufacturers. Thanks Blackhawk, you did us all a solid because life is a lot more organized thanks to you guys. There you go. The chicken and I are out. Be safe. See you later.